A reading from the first book of Samuel. It happened at that time that the Philistines mustered to fight Israel, and Israel went out to meet them in battle. Encamping near Ebenezer, while the Philistines were encamped at Aphek. The Philistines drew up their battle line against Israel. The battle was hotly engaged, and Israel was defeated by the Philistines, and about four thousand of their army were killed. The troops returned to the camp, and the elders of Israel said, "Why has the Lord allowed us to be defeated today by the Philistines?" Let us fetch the ark of our God from Shiloh, so that it may come among us and rescue us from the power of our enemies. So the troops sent to Shiloh, and brought away the ark of the Lord of Hosts, he who is seated on the cherubs. The two sons of Eli, Hophni and Phinehas, came with the ark. When the ark of the Lord arrived in the camp. All Israel gave a great shout, so that the earth resounded. When the Philistines heard the noise of the shouting, they said, "What can this great shouting in the Hebrew camp mean?" And they realized that the ark of the Lord had come into the camp. At this, the Philistines were afraid, and they said, "God has come to the camp." Alas! They cried, "This has never happened before." Alas, who will save us from the power of this mighty God? It was He who struck down Egypt with every kind of plague. But take courage and be men, Philistines, or you will become slaves to the Hebrews as they have been slaves to you. Be men and fight. So the Philistines joined battle, and Israel was defeated, each man fleeing to his tent. The slaughter was great indeed, and there fell of the Israelites thirty thousand foot soldiers. The ark of God was captured too, and the two sons of Eli died, Hophni and Phinehas. The word of the Lord.